Whoa, where am I? I said. I was in a weird, colorful room. The room was moving. I must be on drugs, I said to myself, but I was not. Then I poured it into the game. Wow, I said in disbelief. I'm actually in the game. Now I know what to do. I said to myself, I started walking around, tried my best to get used to the environment. Now I just need to find Landon and Cuphead before that time guy does. But where could they hide? I searched and searched all around, but I couldn't find them. Then I thought about, maybe they're in Elder Kettle's house. I said when a light bulb struck my head. Wait, if the time guy is after me, nah, I thought of. So I entered the, El the Elder Kettle's house. This is where Cuphead and Mugman lived. I walked through room to room, finding nothing, nobody, at all. This might take a while, I said with a low sigh. I'll find them. I know I will. So I kept searching around. I entered the Cup Brothers' rooms, and what I saw in there was horrifying. I saw Mugman's dead body cut in pieces. I was in shock. I ran out of the house as soon as I po as soon as possible. I felt so bad and so sad for what happened to Mugman. After that, all of this, I got a feeling, a strong anger, a, a strong feeling of anger, and I was so mad, and I was just insane. I was really mad at what happened, so I went back in the house, looked for their armory. And what I found in there was a shotgun loaded with ammo. Now I got the gun and I cocked it. <laughs> then ran away searching for Landon and Cuphead. I was finally going to kill this time guy. Minutes later, even though it felt like hours later, <clears throat> I entered the last place I didn't check, a casino. I accidentally ran into the time guy. We looked at each other, then backed away. We stared at each other. But then, Landon and the rest hopped up and looked at us. The time guy took advantage and jumped on me, knocking the gun out of my hands. Landon and the rest just continued hiding like little wussies. They were big babies, I said. Or I thought of when I was gonna beat the crap out of the time guy. I kicked him off. He dropped his weapon too. We started throwing fists at each other. I punched him to the ground. We both really, they, they really both hurt when we punched each other in the face. So I was a little weak, but I was strong enough. I had time. I had time enough time to get my gun. So I did. He rises back up at me, then charged at me. This is a clutch moment. I aimed at his heart when he was running straight at me. And it seems like he was like centimeters away from me, trying to stab me. And then, I pulled the trigger. I heard while closing my shivering, shivering eyes. I won. We won, guys. Guys, we won. We hugged each other, put that time guy's dead body in the trash. Everyone is safe now. I went to Cuphead saying, I'm so sorry that your brother didn't make it. He cried. Then we all started hugging. Well, don't worry. He's in a better place now. Yeah, Cuphead said. Me and Landon walking to the start of the game. Talking and then a portal appeared. This must be our trip home. Yep, Landon said. Let's go. So me and Landon walked into the portal. Everything is normal now. Now we lived our normal lives as 12-year-olds. The time guy was gone, and I got on the laptop with my friend safely. I'll never, ever look up Cuphead on my laptop again. The end. I hope you enjoyed the fourth and final part of our Cuphead Creepypasta, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. This is going to be the final part, but probably soon 
will be coming a new series called Mario Kart 666. And don't worry, it's called by Kirby Pastas will be gone forever. It'll return when you least expect it. Maybe in 2018, like December or something. Maybe 2019. Maybe in 10 years or so, if YouTube's still around. It will come back. Don't worry. Make sure you subscribe. And I hope you didn't get scared. Please, watch this at 3 a.m. in the darkness alone by yourself. Home alone, your haunted house. Enjoy this music. This is Jake the Snake. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like in the video, and bye, subscribers.